with it. Oh, oh he took a bad fall on the shed here. You broke his arm, right, Marty? Yeah, you are so I damn did. clumsy, Marty. All right, all right. All right. Easy. Now, let's get this jacket off. Easy. That's it. Don't worry. I don't want you to worry, all right? And I'll get on the other side of the room. Cross cut take Come on. Just sit down. All right. Be quiet. How did she know about Robert? She's been with Sean every single minute. Are we going to get any breakfast, Sean, or are you going to starve us to death? Well, I thought you'd be too nervous. Oh, no, no, no. I, I'm not the nervous one. I, I'm hungry. Oh. Well, I had my breakfast earlier this morning, but I'm sure when Press gets back, you'll be willing to fix you something to eat. I don't mind cooking. Yeah, I could help her in the kitchen. No problem. No, oh, that's all right. Prescott can do the cooking. Are you a bit scared that they're going to put some, uh, some cleaning fluid in the coffee? No, not at all, but there are a number of ways that they could get into trouble in the kitchen. Oh, Press, I'm glad you're back. You're uh, just in time to help keep Frisco and Felicia out of trouble. I want you guys to stay alert. Don't take your eyes off of these three. All right. All right. You going out? Yeah. I'm going to have a look around the ground, Sam. Hey, Sean, I'm telling you, there's no sign of life in those woods anywhere. No human life, anyway. Good. Oh, and Press, by the way, uh, Fix our guests something to eat, something very good. We wouldn't want to be accused of being inhospitable. All right, fine, whatever you say. Hey, uh, Sean? Have you heard anything from the collector yet? No, not yet, but I can smell Scorpio. He knows I kidnapped his wife, so it's going to be a fight to the death now. Pretty boy, how about some breakfast? Your boss gave you some orders. Hey, you keep your mouth shut long enough, you might just live to eat something, all right? Prescott, behave. No need for threats. Well, why don't you just tell my boss that, okay? My orders are to keep these two junior private investigators in line. You will get chow when I say you get it. Why don't you relax, and I'll make the breakfast, okay? You sure you can handle it with that bum arm? I can handle it. Why don't you try and handle your mouth? Ooh, somehow I get the impression he doesn't like you very much. You think I care? He's not paid to like me. Besides, you should thank me. He's a much better cook than I am. Such a good hand. Uh, Mr. Vane. Yes? Would you like to pick up uh, Marty's hand and finish the game with me? What are you playing? Mr. Gin Rummy. Well, when you say you have a good hand, well, I'm always one for a challenge. I wish you wouldn't antagonize him, especially that one Prescott. I'm not worried about him. He's stupid. They always eventually make mistakes. Prisco, that's crazy. They're crazy enough to hurt you, and I don't want to see that happen. Well, I don't want to see it happen either. I want to get out of here as alive as much as anybody else does. How long can a person live in a total state of panic? Is that how you're feeling? Yes, from day one. I don't know what I would have done if you hadn't been by my side. We're going to get out of here, okay? And you have to keep believing that. I do, I do. But please, don't keep talking to them like that, all right? Okay. I'll keep my mouth shut. Where do you think Sean's going with that gun? He's gonna check outside. Do you think Anna's right? Do you think Robert's out there somewhere? No doubt. I think Robert's out there, and I think he's going to be here very, very soon. Uh, hey, pal, if I were you, I wouldn't really get my hopes up. Robert Scorpio's nowhere near this place. Mm. 